Hey everyone, so today's video is going to be my updated foundation routine. Well, not really updated because I don't think I've done one, but it's like my current. So it could change. I probably can do an update one like later on in the future. But for now, this is my foundation routine and I'm just using the, the e.l.f. Golden Bronzer, the e.l.f. Press Powder, the e.l.f. Contouring Brush and Bronzing Powder, and um my foundation, Laura Mercier, and my e.l.f. Tint Moisturizer. And that is everything I use for my foundation. Um and that's everything I showed y'all how to do. The rest of the stuff like my eye like mascara and then my eyebrows, I do them like not in this video, but I can make a video for them if you want me to. So just let me know. So if you want to see how I do my foundation every day, then just keep on watching. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is apply my tinted moisturizer. This is by e.l.f. in the studio line, and it has SCF 20, which I like, and it also has aloe, cucumber, and vitamins A, C, and E. So this is pretty healthy for your skin. Um, I already applied a regular moisturizer, but it's in my bathroom, so I'm not going to get it. But, uh, so I'm just applying this on top of that, and this is a moisturizer too. It's kind of like, I use this kind of like a primer, because I will apply foundation over this. So I take about that much, which is just a little itty bitty dot, and it's not a lot at all. I just like to put it in, like, dry spots, because, um... It works as a moisturizer and a primer to me. So, and I don't know how well the lighting is. I kind of look washed out in the frame, but it's okay. Y'all will get the idea. Okay, so after I applied my primer slash moisturizer, I'm going to apply my foundation, and I just use the Laura Mercier. So cream foundation in beige ivory, and I don't see if y'all can see that. My camera's not good. But yeah, this is the one I use. Uh, I got this at Sephora. I think it retails for about $42. It is quite expensive and pricey for a foundation, but to be honest, it really does work. Like, it works really, really good. I love the coverage. Um, the only thing is you do have to shake it really good because it's like the type of formula it is. It's like liquidy and chunky at the same time. So you have to shake it up. So yeah, so you can get like all of it and, um, just like shake it. <sighs> and then I apply it to my whole face. Okay, so after I shook it enough, now it's the formula it needs to be and I'm just going to squeeze about that much, not a lot at all, um, it's kind of smudged so it kind of looks like a lot, but it's really nothing, and of course I'm going to close it back, and I'm going to rub it on my fingers, and just like, patting motion around my face, and just rub it in. Ashlyn woke up. <laughs> I'll show y'all like her in a minute when I'm done. Hi, Mama! Okay, so, um, oh, right now I'm using the concealer by Laura Mercier, and I think this is in shade two. And this is just a sample that they gave me, but I will be repurchasing it when I run out. And I just take a little bit. You really don't need a lot because it is so, like, thick and sticky. It goes a long way. So I'm just going to put it under my eyes like this and then you always want to look up when you're putting concealer under your eyes so you look up and then you pat until it's all evened out but you don't want to rub you want to pat and you want to look up So 
so it looks like this. And I know I probably look really funny right now, but, uh, and since I don't have any, like, active breakouts or anything, I don't need to put anything on those. I just have, like, little bumps here and there, but it's okay. I don't need concealer on everything. Um, so then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my e.l.f. press powder, and I just recently, st oh, wow, it's really dirty. I just recently started using this maybe like two weeks ago, and I've really been loving it. I've been using it every single day. It is so inexpensive, $3, and it works really good. And this is in the color Sand. Of course, you probably can't see, but it looks like that, and I really like it. So I'm just going to take a fluffy brush, and this does come with the, um, like, sponge thing, but I do not use that. Hi, boo-boo! So I'm going to take my brush, and I'm going to put it in the thing, like that, and just dab it on my face. all the way around. I will be definitely repurchasing this when I run out and probably will soon because I just hit pan. <laughs> Okay, so I just like to rub it in, like, up and down, kind of, stippling motions, but not really. And then once it's all, I just like to buff it out. <coughs> Ashlyn's talking, I don't know if y'all be able to hear her, but... <laughs> made a dent into it. Did you see that little silver spot? <laughs> yeah, I just hit pan. Oh my gosh, guys. I can't believe this. Okay, and then I like to bring it down to my neck. So... Rub it into my neck. Okay, and then I just go like this, so it's all evened out. And I love this brush, like I use this for everything, and I have like more brushes here, like I have like all of these brushes, and I prefer, there goes one of my brushes, I prefer to use this one for every single thing I do, I just, I don't know, I love this brush so much, like I'm never going to stop using this brush. It works so amazing. I love it. Um, but yeah, so after I buffed it all in, now I'm going to take my contour blush and bronzer powder, and it looks like this, and I really love this. This is just like a dupe for the NARS Laguna and Orgasm duo thing. And I really like this bronzer. Like, it looks like this. And, of course, you know, this is the blush and this is the bronzer. And I apply it. This is the only thing I use this little brush for because this is so pigmented. Like, you only need a little bit. So, a little bit of that. And then I kind of go like this. And then I rub it in. like that and then I'll take some for this side and on camera it looks so much darker than it really is so I promise you it is not that dark it is pigmented but it does not look like that one in person Okay, and then I like to take the blush with the same little itty bitty brush, and I just apply it to the apples of my cheeks. Mm. 
like that. <laughs> and that's it for that. And then I just take my big fluffy brush again and I buff it in. You and it all out. Oh my gosh, I totally recommend getting this. It works like this and this. This is great. I love it so much. Like, definitely check these out. They work so good. I love it, I love it, I love it. Hi, Mama! What are you doing? <laughs> Don't play with that. You crazy girl. And then this is just the Golden Bronzer by e.l.f. And the Studio Line, too, if y'all can see, the packaging is really nice. And this is, like, a little bronzer, but I like to use it as a highlight for up here. Are you okay? So, I'm going to be using this little e.l.f. bronzing contour brush. Bronzing brush. And this is just, like, the dollar line. Um, But I just like to take a little bit of that. And then apply it over here as a highlight, and it is so shimmery and sparkly, it looks so pretty. And then on this side, it's really important to highlight your face for anything because it just makes you look like awake and brightened, and you know, it just makes you look clean, crispy, fresh. <laughs> So, yeah, I just put a little bit of that. I don't know if y'all can see that, but it's really pretty. Hey, baby. And then, I, of course, I go back with my flushy brush, and I just blend. I love this brush. Okay. And that is all for my foundation routine. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um... Let me know if you use any of these products or what do you think or anything like that. No, I just usually go in and I do my eyebrows and then, of course, my eyes and then mascara. And it depends. I don't usually wear eyeshadow every day, but when I do, I'll do my eyeshadow and then I'll put mascara and then liner and all that. So, yeah, but this is my foundation routine. Um, this is everything I do usually. Um, the only things that change is normally the bronzer. Sometimes I'll use, like... Max, um, mineralized skin finish in medium deep, or I'll use um some other bronzers or like blushes like this. Or I just I switch off depends, but that's usually what like I normally use. So, yep. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. What's the matter, Mama? Oh yeah, let me just get her so y'all can see her really fast. Okay, hey. Okay, so here's my boo-boo. She wanted to say hi. Didn't you want to say hi? Look at the camera. Say hi. <laughs> Ash will say hi. Say hi. Now she's trying to touch my makeup. Um, But yeah, thanks for watching. Subscribe. Rate, comment, whatever, you know. You know. And we're going to go now. We're going to go get ready finished getting ready for the day. Got some things planned. Hi, Mama. Okay, so that was my foundation routine. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope that it helped if it did help. Um, so yeah, I recommend you to try this product out. It works really, really good. Also, the this one too, it is such a great dupe for the NARS and it works amazing and it's like the same exact packaging basically. So yeah, this is such a good alternative. $3, way cheaper than like 27 something like that. And it works amazing and it is so pigmented like they're so pretty. Like the colors are really pretty. So yeah, now I gotta go clean my fingers because you see how pigmented that is? That is so pigmented. So yeah, I really recommend those. I hope you check them out. I hope you try them out. And just leave any more video requests in the comments below. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.